Protecting your person and your property against cicadas. New this morning, consumer reporter John Matteries looks into what products might make a difference and which ones maybe won't, so you don't waste your money. We're just hours away from cicadas taking over your lawn and garden. So are there any products that you can buy that could keep them away or at least reduce their numbers? It was the calm before the storm at Benkin Florist and Greenhouse in Silverton, where Marguerite Letcher was making a few last purchases before the cicada invasion. You're not looking forward to cicadas? No, that's going to be home. Beth McDonald was wondering if it's worth trying to protect her landscaping, as her neighbors have done. They put netting all over their trees. Does it work? I don't know. We'll find out. So which products might be worth buying and which are a waste of money? Nursery owner Mike Benkin's first tip is to skip the bug spray. It'll harm you more than them. And cicadas are too big for lawn grub killer. Once that guy flies out, there's not a thing you can do about it. But he says you may want to protect young ornamental trees because cicadas laying eggs could kill their new growth. So he suggests draping them with mosquito netting or wedding fabric. You want to make sure it's completely covered you don't mind if you pull it a little tighter too, it won't hurt it. If you're really concerned about cicadas damaging a small young tree, the experts say the easiest thing to do is to wrap the lower trunk so cicadas can't climb up it. And he can't hold on to that. Mike used clear plastic tape, though aluminum foil can work too. And if you're afraid to even go outdoors, Bass Pro Shop sells a full mosquito blocking suit for just 29 bucks. Finally, Mike Benkin says, don't worry about your flowers and shrubs. Cicadas don't eat them. So don't overdo it and don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris, WCPO 9 News.